Hey guys, in this lecture, we're going to do a small project. What we're going to do is we're going to install LAMP stack using our knowledge of Ansible and playbooks. What you will need to do is you will need to install the following packages Apache 2, PHP, PHP MySQL and MySQL Server. Then you will need to deploy a new index.html file which I have attached with this lecture. So you, you will need to deploy this file onto the remote machine and then you will need to start Apache 2 and MySQL server service using handlers. Now what I want you to do is I want you to pause this video now and give it a go yourself. If you're not able to do it then I will show you how to do it. But first give it a go yourself. I will pause this video and once you've got an answer then come back and compare your answer against mine so pause the video now okay welcome back you if you haven't tried it yourself i would still ask you to go ahead and try it but if you had tried it and either you failed or you want to compare your answer against mine let's head back to the ansible controller so inside my ansible folder i've got the index.html file that is attached to this lecture as well which is a basic html file which we will deploy on the remote machine and i also have a playbook called install underscore lamp dot yaml Inside this playbook, I first specified the environment I'm going to run this playbook against, which is dev. Then because I will be installing packages and restarting services, I've used become yes to gain higher level privileges. Then the first task is to install LAMP packages on the remote machine. I've used apt module and using the package parameter i've supplied it a list of packages that i want to install on the remote machine state is latest to install the latest versions of all these packages then i've called three handlers using the notify mechanism the first one is start apache the second one is start mysql server and the third is deploy index.html after that, I've specified the tasks for all these three handlers. The first one is to start Apache. I've used the service module to start the Apache service. So I've given it name Apache 2 state started and enabled yes. Enabled yes allows me to make sure that the services are available automatically when you restart the server. So it adds this into the boot list of your server. Then I've also done the same thing for MySQL server. And lastly, I've got the task to copy the index.html file onto the remote server inside var slash www slash index.html location. Now let's run this file. So Ansible playbook, the path of the file and install underscore lamp dot YML. Let's run this. Now, as you can see, our playbook was run successfully. And we've got five OKs and two changed. Now to verify, let's head back to the dev system. And on the dev system, let's first check for the status of the MySQL service. It says active and running. And now to check Apache, what we can do is we can open up our browser 
and what we're going to do is we're going to uh, open up the browser for localhost which will send it to the apache server running on the localhost and that apache server will display our index.html file that we've deployed on this box so let's do it so click on firefox now on the, our browser window we can type in localhost to open up our index.html that we deployed so we type in localhost and all we need to do is hit enter now as you can see it has picked up the new index.html file and we've got the relevant text on the screen so this is how you can deploy lamp stack using ansible with this we've come to the end of this lecture thank you for watching i will see you in the next one bye